So hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. So it's time for Fear Again, we're on to episode 12. As always, the more extended version of this reaction is up on my Patreon if you guys are interested in checking that out. The link is in the description down below. There's a whole bunch of other reactions over there. There's a mixture of old shows and new, so you got things like Buffy and the X-Files mixed with newer stuff like Moon Knight and Bridgerton. I also do things like live streams and movie reactions. So yeah, the link to that's down below if you want to check it out. Let's go with Fear. And last episode ended with Wes kind of selling us out, I suppose. Victor, your room service is very aggressive. People have been no ripping up my beds, person. flipping my tables. I think you deserve a partner to help remind you which way is up. Found a wall key in your mattress. <laughs> and he has a yes man like Howard who won't question him. That's exactly why he likes him. That's why he likes Howard. Well, what he likes and what he needs are two different things. Oh, uh, that better not be Charlie. Your skin. Are those? Radiation pills. Keep her comfortable for uh, whatever time she has left. Are they going to kill Charlie off? Shit. Where? Who had one? Howard. His right-hand man had a walkie? Man. Finally, it's about time we've seen Strand. God, we haven't seen him in what feels like forever. Everything to me. You know the rules, Howard. I didn't do this. I need people I can trust. Now, more than ever. You did the walk. He's been loyal to Strand all along. Is Strand that paranoid that he can't see this is a setup? Infants don't just vanish into thin air. She wasn't in her crib when I came to check on her. I'll find her. I get that he's paranoid, I understand that, and I can understand why. But he is the one motherfucker that well, Strand can trust here. I would think. This tower is bigger than the both of us. It is my future. It is the way I'll be remembered. My legacy it doesn't end well. Well, maybe he... You know what? He might be able to fill John Dory's void, because I feel like since he left, it's just the tone has changed for me. Why would I put her in danger like that? Because you don't want her to grow up. Good point. You're angry about You know what Rowan is. I have a feeling she does. We both want the same thing. Thanks, John. That's not an answer, June. How, do, how, how does one keep a child a secret? They're noisy little bastards. Talk to me, June. Maybe I can help. No, I don't think I will. She kind of reminds me of the Carol of the Fear Universe. Quite the collection you got here, Howard. Look, I don't got time for this. I have to find that baby. <laughs> Strand is gonna kill me, okay? He had me dangling over the edge earlier. Did that walkie turned up in here? It wasn't mine. Whoever put it here, they are getting exactly what they want. Dead I Ducky died in these boots. Blackwater. Alright, well I don't I don't Whoever know. Put it here, I don't know who that is. Exactly. But they look like some clean Nick Grimes boots, don't they? Drink. Ah, I don't touch this stuff anymore. Now, Ben, where are they? Dead. Doesn't take a genius, my guy. I don't know. The Travis letter is one of the most famous documents in the history of Texas. Huh. What people didn't know was that there was more to it. I traveled all over giving lectures, months and months away from the team and his mom. Mm -hmm. Sounds like quite the achievement. Did you dip your dick I into it. other women? He said I was more concerned with making history than I was with making a life for her and my son. I have made history here. So you're still more concerned with making history than anything else. Someone. You haven't changed or grown at all. It, they'll see okay. this history Good to know. Be their life. Interesting that we're finally getting back. Sorry though. You've already combed the place. And comb again. Our short king is angry. Are we done here? Find him them fucking walkies. June, there appears to be a box crying over there. That's why this needs to happen now. It's not safe. Uh, fuck off, will ya? Where's the child? Is she still floating around in the box? It was a fucking horrendous plan, by the way, June. Okay, but now we're in a shit store with a bunch of walkers. June, babes, this is no place for a child. The walkie. I planted it how it's wrong. Partially guessed. Is this supposed to be a big reveal? What the fuck? 
How, how, there ain't no way both of them are making it out of this situation alive. Suddenly we have a NFL player. Was that the right sports term? Did the NFL guys wear the big helmets? I'm in two minds about this. He probably should have ran, but at the same time he couldn't because there's more walkers down the tunnel. Did you really just back, back into the place that you were trapped two seconds ago? Ah, oh, I'm getting really sick of this fucking radiation storyline. So you're telling me radiation is after killing Charlie or it's gonna kill Charlie and it's gonna kill him too? He must have got exposed to the same thing she did. I was careful. I was quick. Seems to me we've identified the resistance. It's exactly This ain't Star Wars. We found the baby! What a coincidence! Told you I'd find her. You didn't find her. Either. Oh, that cut him deep. You could see the hurt that that caused him. I really appreciate Strand's determination to theatrics. He's like, my office is on the roof. We are going to hold conferences, come hell or high water, or hailstones. Push him over the What? What? You heard me. We had a deal. I said I'd spare you because I planted that walkie. I did not think he was going to come clean about that. He's, Strand is going to love that. He's going to be like, genius, iconic, we love it. You don't do something like that unless you're invested. Come on, you can't be serious. I'm I won't do that. You will do it. He just wants unless Howard dead. That's it. No. Hey, He's wait. just like, I don't care. Just kill him. Lads, characters are dropping in this show faster than I can keep up with. Our scouts found them months ago. They've been turned for a long time since he you knew his wife and son were dead. And you didn't tell him? said nothing? Why would I? John should... All of the alarm bells that John has available should be going off right now. His apartment is all yours. You can move in immediately. I'd be straight back down with June. Like, hey, yeah, you gotta get the fuck out of here. I was wrong earlier. Son of a bitch is crazy. So he's sick already. He's feeling the impact of the radiation already. I thought you were off the sauce. Howard certainly has no use for them anymore. Given the fact he's dead. <laughs> Am I right? <laughs> clink, clink. Why so loud? So I can't hear your so bullshit. Loud, I'm going to remand Mo to my soul custody permanently. That baby is never going to give you what you want. When I want your counsel, I'll ask you. You walked into his office, man. You ran your plan by him. You kind of did ask. Are you still close by? I got special delivery for you. Did this man really dress himself in every piece of history he could find in the in the room? I got this. You got some brass moons, my friend. How about me? Here's some beach ball size lady nuts, I'll give him that. This kid is like, I don't want to go with him, I'm not going to stay out of his fucking outfit. This man does not know what he's doing with his life. I don't quite understand the hat. Oh, wait. Is he anticipating getting chomped on the skull? Is he going to be Strand's right hand man now? Come on, surely he would be absolutely overcome by these walkers. Oh, look who it is. Surely none of these walkers should be able to walk because if most of them were thrown off the edge of the Victor. building as like punishment, their legs should be absolutely out of action. This is ridiculous, man. I, I, what? And isn't the kid now exposed to radiation because she's like right against where the worst of the infection on, on him is? Or is that not how radiation works? I don't know. The show makes no sense to me anymore. I'm trying, I'm really trying, but this, this part of the season is... Ooh, how did he make it through the... We can cut your shoulder off. I'm sorry. You take care of her, Morgan. I will. Yeah, I had a feeling he wasn't making it out of this Thanks, episode. Man. You may have won the battle today, Morgan. But the war is just beginning. Just hold the kid up, wave her around, and be like, yeah, well, I have the kid now, so haha. Fuck you, I win. Keep everyone else. I'm out of here. As for the rest of you. The offer to join me still stands. 
I need good people here to help me secure the future of this place. I need good people so I can corrupt them. Morgan ran across the country once. He can do it again. He should just take off. He should just fucking leave. Like, you're really going to kill off two pretty big characters in one... In episode 12? I don't... Listen, I don't know what they're doing with this half of the season, but they need to... They need to not. They just need to not. I've stood by fear through, like, a lot. But the last three or four episodes have just been a mess, being honest. Um, I liked the shock factor of this one, I guess, but you're still just going to kill two major characters? Just in episode 12. Just fucking throw them in. Throw the deaths in and throw the characters out. But yeah, that's it for this reaction, you guys. Uh, the more extended version, like I said at the beginning, is going up on Patreon. Link to my Twitter and my Instagram is also down below. So thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you all soon.